Hey girl, so welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kia, AKA Key Blessed. And family, welcome friends, welcome, 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 welcome. So pretty much I'm starting off this week's vlog with just showing y'all what I've created so far this week. It's not much, it's not much, but I did have some things that I wanna go over, talk about some things that I wanna get done this week. And hopefully, because I said it, I will do it and it will happen. So far this week, I've made a few hats. I've just joined a local group in my area that does markets. Y'all, I'm so excited. Like she just added me to the group chat last week. So I get to see all of the events that's coming up and things like that. So we have events coming up all of November and all of December. Now, here's the, here's the thing. Here's the thing. I don't know which date I want to choose. I've been trying to decide that since she added me to the group. Two events that I saw is like not far from my house at all. So I don't really have to travel um, a long way. So I'm really excited about that. I'm really excited with, you know, just getting some market experience. Like I be seeing the videos and the pictures on Instagram and it just seemed like a vibe like it just seemed like such a welcoming atmosphere so i am so excited y'all but i've been trying to figure out what date i want to choose because i just don't know now i don't want to pick a date and then be stressing myself out trying to get everything made up i just want to get some stuff accumulated get some stuff done and then you know choose a date so then all i have to do between the time that i choose the time that i pay and the time that the event is happening is prep and come up with my setup. I got some business cards made. I do have to order some bags. I, I have a lot to do. I have a lot to do. I wasn't going to start a business out of this. This was just like a hobby for me. And it still is. Like, I don't want to grow out of love with what I'm doing. I don't want to do that. So... I'm just really treating lightly. I'm really just having fun with it. And I feel like a market would be fun. Like there's other, there's tons of vendors there. Sometimes it's like um, different big events going on. Like the last one that I just seen, it was like Macaroni Fest. And it was so many people there, so many different vendors. So I'm excited to showcase my pieces. I'm excited. Even if don't nobody buy anything, I just want to be there i just want to be in the atmosphere i think it'll be so much fun oh, that being said i'm gonna show y'all what i've made so far this week i've made nothing but hats this week so far first hat i'm gonna show y'all is from my scrap ball remember the scrap ball i showed y'all so here's the scrap bucket hat the colors look kind of odd together i'm sorry i'm looking at my son if y'all see me looking over here because he's sitting on his pot we're a potty tree when I did preschool, y'all, I was like the potty training queen. So I just feel like I got this. Anyways, it came out so cute, y'all. Look at the colors. Look at the colors. Ah! I love it. I did a wavy brim hat. And she's cute. I think I like her better than the ruffles. But what I'm thinking about doing with her is, remember on the last video how I told y'all I wanted to try out surface, surface stitching? well i've been watching some videos and i don't know if i should do it on this hat because with surface stitching you have to work under your project and i think it's going to be kind of difficult for me to try it on the first time on a hat but that's just that's just what i do i like to challenge myself i guess i don't know girl but we gonna try to do it 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 hey. the color that i want to use is this pretty pink y'all and either i'm gonna stitch i don't know if i'm gonna do a whole word or just like a a heart or whatever i'm gonna do whatever is easiest for me to do on my first try because i'm not about to set myself up for failure which i probably already am because i've never done it but i think i want to do the word believe and this color so that's pretty much what i'm going to be trying um after this clip and i might show y'all i might record i don't know don't hold me to that it's just a basic beanie i use my cinnamon color that i love 
so much. I just made a regular beanie. You can wear like, you know, you can wear a regular beanie any type way like that. Or you can roll it up. But yeah, I think I like it like that. That's so cute. I'm gonna make a lot more of these. I got a lot of neutral colors to get rid of. I got some brown, some black, some orange. I'm just gonna make, what's funny? But let's go ahead and try this surface stitch and I will see y'all in the next clip. Okay y'all, so I told y'all I was gonna come back and kind of show y'all how I'm doing with the surface stitch. So I took two, um, what are these called, um, stitch pins and I just put them right here on each side of the hat, kind of make a mark of like where I want to put the letters so that they'll be straight. And so as you can see, I did a P, it's going to say period, um, but I did a P right here and now I'm working on the E. Now, I will show y'all, like, what I'm doing, but I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just learning, so I can't really, I don't want to do, like, no tutorial or nothing, but. Yeah, y'all, it's coming out cute, girl. And then after I get it done, if I can get all the letters to line up right, I'm going to outline the border of the brim with the same color. I think that'll be cute. That's the E, girl. Okay, so I thought I wasn't gonna have enough room to put the rest of the letters, so I put it on the mannequin. That's a good way to kind of measure and see where you are. So I have plenty of room for the rest of the letters. So yeah, y'all. The E, I think this stitch right here, I could have left off. I put an extra stitch. I could have stopped it right there. So it won't look so flicked. But I mean, it's my first time, y'all. The letter's not gonna come out perfect, but you know. Nothing beats a failure but a try. Hey girl, I'm back. So, y'all, I did it. Bitch, where's here it go? <laughs> y'all, don't laugh, okay? It says period. It says period. And I don't know. I think I did good for my first time. Now, of course, I'm not going to sell this. It looks a little flicky. But this was just for practice. The letters are a little lopsided, but you know, you win some, you lose some. You get better with practice. So I'm gonna keep practicing. Um, I really wanna learn how to do tapestry cause I think that'll look much neater than this. But I think as far as like making personalized gifts for like family members or friends, putting their name on it or something you know they like, like a logo or, um, you know, their birth date or a heart or, you know, their initials, something like that. I think it'll be really personable. So I don't know if I'm gonna sell it. I threw the pink on there to match this. And I th I'm gonna show y'all what it looks like on the mannequin. How it looks on the hat. <laughs> y'all, it don't look that bad, like off camera, but on the camera. It's looking like, girl, what did you do? What did you do? <laughs> you laughing at my project? Okay. All right, girl. All right. I'm going to let y'all go. I'm going to let y'all go. I'll, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Hey, girl. So... We about to do a little crochet with me segment. I'm just making another regular beanie. Um, I just finished making an orange one. Orange. Now I'm about to make a green one. Get y'all crochet hooks, get y'all yarn, and let's crochet together, sis. Let's have some bonding time. Why are you messing with my toes? Go play with your toys. All right, y'all, I'm about to cut the TV on for my baby because he's doing the most.
So it is the next day and I just wanted to show y'all something. A sure cat had her babies in our backyard and they are growing up, they're getting so big, y'all. For a while, they slept under our, um, excuse my backyard, it's a mess right now, but they slept under our patio. As you can see, there's another one right there. I named them, it's seven of them, but it's only two back here right now. I don't see the other ones, but yeah, they're so cute. That's Tiger back there. And this right here, this is Nina. Y'all, so we are about to go on a walk. <laughs> because it is a beautiful day outside, so yeah. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> It's a beautiful day, y'all. It's fall. Breeze blowing. The leaves are turning. Hey, girl. I'm working on filling the water. I'm working on a all black uh, wavy brim hat. So that's what I'm working on currently. I got two more orders to fill. I have to fill, do a rainbow ruffle hat and also a blue cat beanie with the pierced ears. So I'm running to Joanne's tomorrow because I gotta grab some yarn, some more yarn to fill these orders. And um, also I wanted to make me a stack of bracelets. I want, I like beaded bracelets so I haven't been able to find any or find any for a reasonable price or even find any that I like. So I'm gonna make my own. Or I'm gonna attempt to make my own. So tomorrow when I go to Joanne's, I think I'm gonna get me some beads to make my own stack of uh, beaded bracelets. And I think I might do that on camera with y'all. I don't know. Don't hold me to that, girl. Don't hold me to that. But I think I might do it on camera with y'all. If not, y'all know I'm definitely gonna show y'all the bracelets when I'm done. So I love bangles. I'm a bangle girly, but um, I love beaded bracelets too. And I love charm bracelets. So if I can find some charms for a reasonable price, I might um, throw some charms on there, but we'll see. So this is pretty much what I'm doing right now. I'm about to go ahead and finish this hat and I will get back with y'all. I just did a little Sunday reset. Let the windows open to get some fresh air in because it feels so nice outside today. As y'all can see, me and my son do share a small space together. Um, but I think he's at the age where it's time for him to have his own little space. So pretty soon I'm gonna be turning my walk-in closet into like a little room area for him. I think, you know, he's really small, he's really young. So I think that will be enough space for him. Um, I'm gonna actually show y'all what that looks like. This is our, um, this is my walk-in closet. Right now I have, have it set up where um, all of his clothes are on this side, as y'all can see. I got his, like, his pants and stuff up here, his shoes up here. Those are all of our hats up at the top. 
this is my side of the closet um but yeah so this is like the floor space and i don't know if y'all could kind of see but if all of this stuff is like moved out there's like wall to wall like kind of space in here to like put a bed and stuff like that so i think this will be enough little um enough space for him I'm trying to move back so y'all can see i think this will be enough space for him to get like a little room set up but that'll be another video for like a whole nother time hey girl so hey. i'm about to show you what i got from jojo okay so i have to close the window they had a lot going on out here so um So I guess we are about to show y'all what I got from Jojo. So um, I got the blue yarn for the cat beanie that I'm gonna be doing with the pierced ear. I also got the rainbow yarn for the ruffle head that I gotta do. And I got the stuff to make the beaded bracelet that I was telling y'all about. So these are the bracelets that I the beads that I got. And I wanted to get like some <laughs> neutral colors that'll kind of match with everything. Oh, cool. It's so pretty, y'all. And then I just, and I got the elastic. So that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to cut this because I'm gonna go ahead and make these bracelets and then get started on the rainbow ruffle hat. Gotcha. Ah. Say bye. So sadly, we've reached the end of this video. Thank you for spending time with me this week. I had so much fun making these bracelets, y'all. They came out so freaking cute. My next set is going to be like some earthy tones with some greens and blues. If you're new to my channel, please put a heart down below so that I can say, hey, girl. Please don't forget to subscribe, like the video, and turn on your notification bell so you can be notified when I post new videos. Like, y'all got to keep up with me. Support. Support your girl. All right. So, y'all. With that being said, we've reached the end. See y'all next week.